What's going on there guys and welcome back to our channel. We're aware that many of you are very interested in learning what transpired between Khloe Kardashian and NBA player Tristan Thompson. Keep at it with this video to learn more about the pain that the Kardashian stars endured. Number 6. Unsettling News Can you believe the Kardashians' season finale is almost here? Viewers finally get to see Khloe Kardashian cope with learning about her ex-boyfriend Tristan Thompson's most recent infidelity scandal in the devastating last episode of the first season. In the episode, Kris Jenner also collaborates with Travis Barker to create a Christmas song, but that's a topic for another day. What you need to know, in case you haven't been following the Tristan controversy, is as follows. Tristan admits to having an affair with Marilee Nichols around the end of 2021. Marilee alleged Tristan was the father of her child after becoming pregnant. Tristan took a paternity test and was subsequently identified as the father. The family was shooting their Hulu program at the time, which was back in December. As the camera started to film, production was able to capture the moment when everyone learned the news. Additionally, audiences saw Chloe's horrifying response in real time during the season finale episode. Number 5. Finding out with the rest of the world Finally, a first-person account of Khloe Kardashian's reaction to Tristan Thompson cheating on her and fathering a kid with someone else is available. On the Kardashians, Khloe's emotional reaction to the news was documented during a chat with Kim during which she could be heard sobbing. She also talked at length to her sisters and in on-camera interviews. During a confessional, Khloe remarked, I learned what Tristan is doing with the rest of the world. Not doing it would be polite. But okay, if you do it, you're not even going to give the rest of the world a fucking heads up. It's simply another smack in the face for me. It's embarrassing. I feel ashamed. I would rather be by myself than in a crowd. Number 4. A Betrayal Hurt Chloe claims that the betrayal is what hurts the most. She also clarified that in a circumstance like this, I'm not sure whether one thing hurts more than the other. Everything is a lie. Everything is a betrayal. Everything is a kind of dishonesty and manipulation. Did Tristan get the chance to tell me everything? Yes. If there wasn't a kid involved, was Tristan going to inform me? No, not at all. And it speaks something about his character. Everything about it is abhorrent. Then Chloe informed Kim that it's horrible, offensive, humiliating, and a joke. Everybody is in on it. Even though I didn't pay for tickets to this folking circus, I'm here in the audience seeing all of these clowns perform. I don't want to attend this performance, hence I want a refund or a return to sender. All of it was a lie, she said. I'm repeating every event, every great gesture, every vacation, every date, everything. God, how did you manage to remain silent? I feel like I'm simply going through the motions and not really in my own body as these things just seem to be occurring. But I guess when something bad happens to you a number of times, you kind of stop caring, which is very awful. Number 3 unidentified fan submission. The rumor first surfaced on the Instagram gossip account Dumoy, which got a tip that the good American creator was seeing another NBA player according to an anonymous post. On Friday, June 17th, a fan account called Kardashian Social uploaded screenshots on Instagram along with the caption, who knows if this is genuine and I know she doesn't need anybody, but I cannot wait for her to have someone like Kravis and Keat one day because I know she will. Chloe acknowledged the news wasn't factual, but she appreciated the kind message. Absolutely not true. I adore you. Thank you for the kind wishes, but I don't see a soul, she said on Instagram on June 18th on Saturday. Number 2. Child Support Lawsuit She and Thompson have a 4-year-old kid together. Chloe is revisiting the breakup turmoil with the Kardashians, even though the two most recently divorced in late 2021. Chloe's love story ended in sadness, while the first season of the new reality program saw Kim Kardashian finding hers with Pete Davidson and Kourtney Kardashian attempting to have children with Travis Barker. She acknowledged on Twitter on Thursday, June 16th, after the publication of the season 1 finale on Hulu, This was certainly a painful episode, but there's so much beauty in witnessing how close my family is. We're devoted to one another and will always stand by one another. The emphasis of the show was on what happened when the family discovered that the NBA player was being sued for child support by Marilee Nichols, whom he acknowledged to having a sexual relationship with in court records. At the time, he was still seeing the reality star. Number 1. 
public display of regret. Despite Tristan initially denied fatherhood, the paternity test result that came back positive in January allowed for the father of Marilee's newborn son to be identified. In a post on his Instagram story, he expressed his sincere regret to Chloe, saying, I accept full responsibility for my choices. I'm looking forward to parenting our kid peacefully now that paternity has been confirmed. You don't deserve this, Chloe. You don't deserve the suffering and embarrassment I've put you through. The way I've treated you throughout the years, it's not something you deserve. Without a doubt, my behavior hasn't matched how I feel about you. This is the end of the video, guys. So let us know your thoughts about all of this in the comments down below. If you enjoyed the video, then let us know by smashing that like button. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel as well as hit that notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos in the future. We appreciate your interest and time. And until the next one, guys, good luck and take care.